Hey Crafty Ram, in this video we are making this oversized balloon centerpiece. So if you want to learn how to make this balloon centerpiece for your next uh, travel themed baby shower, then stay tuned. Well, the first thing you want to do is start with your five inch balloons to construct your cloud base. You're going to inflate all the five inch balloons and round them out on the top. Um, you will need you will need eight pairs of the five inch white balloons. As you're blowing them up, make sure you tie the two balloons together to create dupes. Once you have all your dupes uh, rounded out and tied together, you're gonna wanna make quads. You're going to twist each pair together so you have four sets of quads. Next you're going to cut your 260 in half, um, cutting off the end and then cutting it, folding it in half and cutting it in half to start the dumbbell method. The dumbbell method is created by tying one end of the 260 to each quad and then once you have two sets of dumbbells you're going to twist one set around the bottom and then twist the next set around the other set and the base to create a cloud. Move on to the top of the centerpiece. The top of the centerpiece is made of eight 12 inch balloons twisted together to make one giant cluster. So you're going to start with your you're going to start with your 12 inch balloons and blow them up just like you did the five inch, tying the light colors together. Since there are different, since I am using different colors, you'll want to make sure you are tying. Um, the same color together and not mixing the colors together. Here I am rounding out, I am actually using only two red, two of the dark blue, and then we're gonna actually use four total of the pale blue. Once you have your cluster twisted together by twisting all pairs of all colors together, you're gonna blow up 16 of the five inch balloons. So the colors of these balloons and the number will depend on how many colors you're using. I used four, I had four 12 inch large balloons. So I used, um, I used four, or a total of eight Five inch balloons for that this time around when I do do the dumbbell method method I will be only tying one end one pair to one end and one pair to another end so here I'm tying the one pair of the red balloons on one end and then stretching it out and then tying the red balloons on the other end once you have your dumbbells created you just want to wrap it around one of the one of these similar balloons. So in this case, if you are doing the dark blue color, then you would take the dumbbell of the dark blue color and wrap it around the larger pair. And you just have to wrap it around once and just let it nestle into the open space that's on the side of each balloon.
once you have your cluster completed with its fillers, you're going to cover the top of the stand with a extra balloon, slide your cluster on top of the stand. This, because the other balloon is on top of the balloon base, it's already gonna create friction, and so therefore you don't really have to secure it with anything unless you want to, um, unless you are gonna be outside using this uh, project. Then you're gonna secure the teddy bear with fishing line. Um, I just kind of tied him, tied a few knots around him using like two feet worth of fishing line. Once I did that, set the bear on top of the cloud formation, um, tied him, tied that around the pole of the centerpiece. I added a few suitcase, red suitcases as accents to go along with my theme and bring the idea together. If you want to see more, please click on the screen and I'll see you in the next one.